Hi everyone, and welcome to Easy Tutorial Vids. In this video, I'll show you how to correct the problem where the notes are shifted after recording your performance on your keyboard. It's actually very simple to correct this in FL Studio. Just go to Options, Audio Settings, and move this offset slider to whatever amount the MIDI notes are shifted. And that's it. Now, since we're still setting FL Studio up, I'll show you how to systematically check if you have this problem and how to correct it. So to do this, disable auto quantize by selecting none. Turn off the metronome and the wait for input to start playing buttons. Turn off the countdown before recording button. And let's switch to a tempo of about 100 BPM to make this process a bit easier if you're still learning how to play the keys. Now enable recording and start recording while matching the metronome. I deliberately match my recording to a whole beat in the first bar and a second note beat in the second bar. As you can see, FL Studio didn't align my performance properly. It shifted the notes to the left. It's possible yours is off by a smaller or even a greater amount. In my case, it's out of sync by approximately 100 milliseconds too early. Let me show this more clearly by switching the piano roll snap settings to a half beat. Each note should have been aligned more closely to the vertical lines since my performance was fairly accurate. Let me put the snap settings back to step, which is equivalent to the 16th note beat of the second part of my performance. This because now I'm going to manually quantize these notes, and this snap setting is what the manual quantize tool and the piano roll will snap to. Now, the problem with these shifted notes is that even if I quantize this, it's still off. And that's a problem. This has to do with how your system deals with timestamps, if it's rather Windows MIDI or direct music. Fortunately, we don't need to get into all that, because FL Studio has a very easy way of dealing with this as shown earlier. Go to Options, then Audio Settings. This offset slider here is now our best friend. If your case is similar to mine, where FL Studio shifted the MIDI data to the left, Move the slider over to the left. I know I have an offset of about 100 milliseconds, which you can read off here. So I'll just type in the value. Let's record again to see what happens now. Okay, now this is much better. Let's temporarily switch the snap settings again to compare. See, even without quantizing, it's aligned more accurate. Now, when I quantize, it's perfectly aligned. Now, if in your case the MIDI data is moved to the right, it may be due to latency. So, before moving the slider to the right, First try different device drivers, which I also explained in a previous video. And use the recording method I just showed you to see if that's the case. Okay, so now that the basic setup of your keyboard is done, let's look further into assigning your keyboard's knobs and faders and how to make a backup of those settings in the next video. See you there. 